today we're opening something very special to me, and that is the Switch Tears the Kingdom OLED Edition. I am so excited for this. I've had the original Nintendo Switch from launch rocking it since the launch day. Um, I, I'm a huge Zelda fan. I've been playing since the original on the NES, and this just brings back so many memories. I'm so excited for Tears of the Kingdom. So let's just, without further ado, get right into it. Uh, so this is the box here. I have uh, I have a couple gold edition games because I want to show some stuff off here. So we're going to open this up, see what's inside. And right off the bat, we have these gold Joy-Con, and they look beautiful. And the reason why I have all these consoles, like these these games and controllers, it's just like the theme is back. The gold. It's it, it's 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 back, guys. Look at this. I love it. I love this aesthetic. I love everything gold with Zelda. It just it just goes. It just goes well. And then and then they have the uh, the swirls. And the Zonai green there. This looks so nice, guys. Use the side here. Put the switch over here. Because that's going to be the last thing we look at, I think. All right, what else is in here? We got a cable. We got the power adapter. We got the Joy-Con holder thing. Nothing special about it. No... No, like, gold. But we do have this nice gold strapped white Joy-Con connectors. Like, these little adapters. I love these things. I have so many, sw like... So, I, I only have one Switch. Well, now two. But, like, I have so many Joy-Con because they fail. My best Joy-Cons to date, though, are those Skyward Sword Joy-Con. But look at this. This looks so nice. It's going to look great attached to these Joy-Con. And here we go. We got the switch dock. Now the only the only switch dock that I technically own is the original. While my fiance has the uh, Animal Crossing edition, and she also has the the uh, Smash Brothers edition. But wow, I'm amazed by this one. Like the gold on the back. I like the Nintendo Switch logo on the top. That's that's not on my OG. But this is the best part. This is this is this is the real deal right here. Look at this. You got the gold. Again, you have the Triforce pieces. You got the emblems right there for you know Din Furoru and uh, and uh, Naru. I, I I can't say Furoru for the life of me. I can't. I try. Uh, power, wisdom, and courage. I love it. I love it. And then you got the nice, like, the double dragons eating each other kind of thing. The whole, like, Tears of the Kingdom theme. Man, this is such a good console. I love this. I love this console. And last but not least, we will look at... Well, there's, like, instruction manuals and stuff here. Nobody cares about that. What we care about, though, is this. This baby right here. Let's look at it. I've not seen a Switch OLED in person. This is my first time seeing the screen. It is mighty big. Sorry, you can see the camera there, but whatever. And then on the back, we have the swirlies. I feel like they could have done a little bit more with this. Maybe we'll know more once the game comes out as to like what the significance of these swirlies are. But it would have been nice if there was like a Triforce in there or something. And look at this. I think this is like one of the best improvements of this Switch. This really big kickstand. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Um, so, Tears of the Kingdom comes out in just a couple weeks, guys. Let me know down below if you're hyped for this game. Uh, if you actually got this edition let me know if this is your first switch and i'll catch you next time on tadros uh please that's my pokemon channel or right here and you could also check me out live at twitch.tv slash tadros where i do things like this opening live with my community and i'd love to see you there check you next time guys
Have a good one.